Welcome to our series on the most common tomato plant diseases and pests. In this segment, we'll be covering septoria, blossom end rot, and early blight. Septoria is a fungus that first appears as water-soaked legions, followed by dark spots with light centers. If left to spread, septoria will continue to kill your leaves, which is your photosynthetic material, and this will affect your overall harvest and flavor. To control the fungus, prune off afflicted foliage before it has time to spread, but make sure that you clean your pruners with an alcohol solution before moving on to the next plant. Blossom end rot is one of the most dreaded tomato fruit afflictions. It's also one of the most common. Blossom end rot is easy to identify. It shows as a sunken black lesion on the blossom end of the fruit. The lesion is caused by calcium deficiency in the soil and it's exasperated by uneven watering. Luckily, the solutions are really simple. Start by adhering to a more even watering schedule. Plants that get too much or too little water are more susceptible to blossom end rot. Another simple remedy is to sprinkle a teaspoon of lime along the base of the plant. You can find this lime at home garden centers and pool supply stores. Early blight is another dreaded fungus in the garden. It's easily identifiable by these dark spots with concentric rings in the center. Starting at the leaves and spreading to the stems, the blight will continue to spread up the plant, killing off your foliage and afflicting your fruit. Early blight will start to appear when the weather is hot and humid and temperatures are between 75 and 85 degrees. To help prevent the onset of early blight, apply a copper-based spray to young plants. You can find this at garden centers and also online. Once the fungus is present, there isn't really much you can do aside from removing the plants and keeping it from spreading to your other tomato plants. But it's extremely important to remove the diseased plant into a trash bag and put it out for the trash, not to put it in your compost pile where the active spores can still spread to your other plants. The key to growing your best tomato garden is to scout your plants regularly. Keep an eye out for these issues and handle them early before they get out of control. Be sure to watch all of our tomato videos at burpee.com. Happy gardening.